All right, guys, I'm Justin Haney. Welcome to Diesel <laughs> Filling Station. And this is The Walking Dead Season 3 premiere. <laughs> Welcome to Nerd Reactor. It's a good intro. It's a really <laughs> good intro. I tried. Camera whore. I, know. I don't know why I said that in the mic. here at uh, the premiere for uh, season three's Walking Dead. I am so, so fascinated by your face. That's that's intense. What are you looking forward for? I'm just kind of glad that T-Dog's still alive. <laughs> ah! If uh, if you saw your mom bitten by by a zombie, would you would you kill her? No question. <laughs> No question, no hesitation. We have a couple of men members here uh, slaying zombies. Uh, we have the weapons right here. You see them? Little PP shooters. I like to call them little PP shooters. Y'all got your code names? Like Fluffy. Who would you think would be the first one to go out of our team? Unfortunately, I would think Lupa would go first. I can agree to that. What? Say that again? I said I can agree to that. Wait, one more time? I can agree to that. Yeah, I like cheese too. One more time. <laughs> if the world was flooded with zombies, we would eventually go. I give myself probably like six to eight months. You you would say you would like go all the way through through the zombie apocalypse. Take a fucking bullet to my head before a zombie could eat me. Taking take a what? A bullet to my head. Uh, I thought there were adjectives before that word. So, uh, in a couple words, what are we doing here? We're just here celebrating. We're celebrating everything that is a zombie. Let's say I was a newcomer, I'm a noob, uh, and I wanted to catch one of these premieres. Uh, what time do you think I should come? If you show up at 8 o'clock, I have no sympathy for you. Oh, wow. I suggest before the sun goes down, light dusk, 5, 6 maybe, and you might have a chance to get in. This guy is uh, six foot six. I stand at five, eight and a half. I just want to see like his zombie reach. So if he, if he like attacked me, he would have like... Yeah, a good bit. A good bit on me. So this is pretty scary. How long did it take you to put on your zombie makeup? Uh, no, this is, I wake up and I'm, I'm fully prepared like this. Oh, wow. A game at all times. That, that is, that's fantastic. I easily fold, easily fold. Look at this face. How long did it take for this bad boy? Well, hair Two, three hours? No, nah, it was, hair and makeup did it. I was asleep. <laughs> zombie apocalypse. Where would you hide out? My gym. It's an MMA gym. Nice. You're a fighter. Uh, kind of. Okay, kind of, kind of. I own a MMA fighting gym, not a fighter. Yeah. Would you sacrifice some of your friends? No. Yeah. No, I wouldn't sacrifice her. If you were really I, hungry. She's a <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's the devil's advocate. If you're really hungry. I think the gym's a good idea because he's got weapons, but food, you got to think about that. You have a lot of so you're down for eating people. <laughs> <laughs> Are you, you going to eat Ichi? That's his dog. I'm not eating my dog. <laughs> My you would dog. sacrifice, you let a, no, a dog no, become zombie? No, I would never sacrifice a dog. I would eat people though. Have you ever shot a gun before? Yes, I have. Yeah. A shotgun in particular? A lot of times, yeah. Have you shot a dog? Have I shot a dog? No. Why would you ask that? I, I don't know. Why would you eat people? Uh, so how do you think about this line at Diesel? And there you have it. So we're here with Alex Axed. Alex, and Alex has been a zombie in all three seasons, even this current season. Uh, I'm one of the ones almost get hit by the Camaro. I'm one of the hands in the door. Can we see those pretty hands, please? Hey, how are you? Oh, I recognize those hands. You right? Yeah, I know those hands. I busted through the candy glass going into the department store, and this season, either I got stabbed in the face by Steve. How'd that feel? Great. It was a great really? bar. Wow. So it, either that one's going to make it, it, or Andrew Lincoln's uh, snipers me from one of the gun towers at the prison. You know what? If if I was stabbed with a crowbar, I, it best be on the show. Know what I mean? Check this out. We've we've been uh, freshly feasting on humans. 
and got a shirt. Check the wrong day and get that off so it takes you to the future. <laughs> First place you would hide out if the zombie apocalypse was to happen tomorrow? Uh, my attic. You're a fan of the series? I don't know. If you had to, would you travel it in a small group or would you like to move in a big group for a zombie apocalypse? Small group, definitely. Small group? Yeah. How many, like two, three, uh, no, five? Four. About four? Four? Yeah. Four is a good number. Co-ed, two and two? Yes, sounds good. Yeah, you gotta procreate. Okay, good, good. That's the first thing I think of when a zombie apocalypse happens is procreating. If there was a zombie apocalypse, for your downtime, aside from like killing zombies, what would you do? I'd hang out with my dog Coco. What would you do with Coco with, with zombies around? Oh, she'd get him for sure. Fetch? Oh yeah. Yeah. Fetch an arm. Board games? Any board games? <laughs> no, she's not good at board games. No, not not the dog. <laughs> what? Hello? Is this thing on? <laughs> I, I thought that of this like great idea. Like if you had like a hockey uh, hockey mask and you put it on like a zombie and you put mittens on the zombie, it would be like a pet, no? They'd be too stinky. How about your dog? You you have to pick three items to put in the duffel bag. What would those three things be? My dog, Jack Daniels. In a bag? Yeah. Jack Daniels. Yep, Jack Daniels. You would be my partner in crime. <laughs> be like, you know what? We're we're gonna survive. I need you to bring your dog some Jack Daniels. What's the third thing? Uh, I guess I'd have to bring a gun. My husband's telling me gun. Gun? An axe? Some kind of weapon, Mary Ellen, not just booze and a dog. Hey, cut, like, weapon. point it back here. In the background, he was doing this sign, like. <laughs> and she's like, oh, yeah, got it. Got it, baby. Gun. Gun. That's awesome. If your husband, yeah. your husband, was bitten, <laughs> would you kill him? Be honest. Of course, of course. You think you would, you would have the... The yeah. stuff to do it? Yeah. Easy? He's made you that angry. I mean, he's not a zombie. I see that. Sometimes I think about it. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Give this to me. I need a zombie moan. Can you give us a zombie moan? <laughs> that really sounds like the drunk girl trying to pick me up at the bar. It's happened before. Ooh, we got a car coming. Hold on, hold on. It's actually a zombie, yeah. It's a zombie, check it out. Takes forever for zombies to park. God. Women. women zombies. Is she an Asian woman? Asian woman, yeah. Asian woman zombie. How many zombies has he banged? And that's a challenge. A real challenge. That's a legit. No wonder I do the interviews. This is terrible. Did you hear that question? Wow.